All right, I'm going to make a quick video on how to uh, set your codes for your injectors. If you if you're replacing injectors on the VW TDI 2.0, um, the new injectors need to be coded to the computer. Um, they have different uh, values in them based on electronics. So, and the computer will know if you change the injectors. Believe me, there's no way around it. So, where the injector codes are is right here. You can see down in there. Let's see if I can get you guys zoomed in and a light on. Maybe you can see that is the injector code right there. It's something like A L. You can kind of you know, my finger in there. It won't focus. It's not focusing anyway. But the injector code is right on the top of the injector. So clean it. What I do is take a picture of it. You will need a Rostec or you know Vagcom. I only know how to do this with the Rostec. VCDS, um, plug in your VCDS, turn it on, you like you normally do. If you don't know how to use one, you know, it's pretty simple to use. Hook it up, get it working, and then you go to turn on your ignition key. Okay, give it a couple seconds here. And then I go to select control module. I know, guys, it's a little slow. I wanted to do this really quickly for you. And you go to engine. And then you go to long adaption. And then there's the codes are number one cylinder is 71. So you go to 71. This is number one. Read. That's the uh, stored value code. This little thing will pop up here. Let's get a little, uh, a little focused in. Um, and then this is your stored value. That's our, this is your old code for your old injector. Now what you do is you enter in the new code. Um, just so you know, sometimes fives and S's look similar. So if you're coding it in and it says, and you, what I do is I push, I put in the new code and I'm not going to do it right now. Cause I just did them. Uh, you put in the new code. Okay. And you do test test value if it shows up little test value and it shows all a's that means that you misread you're misreading what's written as the code so the 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 s's look like backward z's and the fives look like s's <laughs> just so you know if you're having trouble with putting in the code and you're getting it to it says all test value and it says a, -A, -A, -A that means that you're not reading it correctly so make sure that you get the code the new value in so then uh then when you, when you get the new value in and it's and it tests okay this little save will light up you just push save go to the next one so 71 is cylinder number one 72 is number two 73 is number three 74 is number four your cylinders are such one two three four so start in the beginning front of the engine which is where the timing belt is one two three four enter in those values and you're all set your computer will clear um, that will allow you to go more than 40 miles an hour if you don't do it correctly um, the it goes into a limp mode and it won't uh, it'll say those a's or it'll have incorrect values and um, it will go into a limp mode and your car won't work properly so anyway talk to you in the next video please like share and subscribe